Hello, hello, happy Saturday. You know what, this is a kind of a, a random live, but I thought I would jump on and just kind of share uh, kind of what we have planned for upcoming World Card Making Day. Uh, kind of in celebration of World Card Making Day. So um, hopefully for those of you that have an online account, with us that you got the email kind of giving you the download. And of course I put the link up in the description as well. Um, so that kind of will look, share a little bit of what we have planned for World Card Making Day. Um, you know, I've shared this before when it comes to cards. Uh, my first paper craft uh, niche that I loved was scrapbooking. And I always kind of really judged my cards a lot. And, um, but boy, my there's such a soft spot spot in my heart now for card making. Um, so even if you are similar to what I my my past situation, maybe you're more of a scrapbooker, not much of a card maker. I can tell you that there is something very special about a handmade card, and I'm sure you've received one, and so you've experienced it maybe on the other end. But it's also a really fun way to use your your scraps of paper so those you those those supplies that you most likely have um so i love world card making day it has definitely um always captured me and um like we say here at kiwi lane you know to create that card and then send it out into the world to make a world a brighter brighter place and that is what i i genuinely feel that these these cards do so we have a new product in honor and celebration of upcoming World Card Making Day. It's not World Card Making Day yet, but we're, we're gonna gear us up and so that you guys can have some fun things to create to celebrate World Card Making Day, which is on October 1st, the first Saturday in October. We will be having a live event, which is some fun giveaways and just chatting and creating together. So make sure to mark your calendar for that. Um, if you haven't seen that yet, it's over on our events page on our website. So underneath the community tab, you'll see events and you can RSVP so you get reminders for th those type of events. So that will be happening. But uh, like I said, in honor of card, World Card Making Day, we have a new product special for creating, helping to create really cute, simple cards, right? Cute and simple um, using the Take Comfort. If you guys haven't seen this yet, Again, shared the link up there, but this just got released yesterday, okay? And I can tell you, <clears throat> excuse me, a little itch in my throat. <laughs> there we go. Um, these color palettes were so calming and fun to play with. I loved creating with them. And if you haven't tried your hand at creating some slim cards, they're super fun. Along with this pack, the sentiment card pack, we make sure to give you um, a link that takes you over to a free course that will actually walk you through making some of these fun cards. So really, really, really fun. And the sentiments are just kind of really general enough. <coughs> Excuse me, right when I go live. Um, that, <clears throat> there we go, there we go. I think I got it. That they're great for Yes, sending a little smile or a little thought for somebody that maybe needs a little bit more comfort or a little bit more faith or something like that as well, right? So super, super fun. Lots of fun ways that you can create with this sentiment pack. And it has various different sentiments in it. Actually here, just this sentiment alone, where did I just put the other one? Thinking of you. Oh, it's right there. Here. So here's one sentiment or you can do traditional size cards. So lots of fun ways that you can create with those in that as well. Um, even down to this little flip card. So another new designer template we used was this triple plaque. So this triple plaque is a three in one designer template. It's actually how we are accomplishing this triple layer effect that you see here on this card, so easy. Again, combine this with the Take Comfort Kit and you will have six adorable cards. These are the six cards actually. So here's one of them, here's another one. And this is just, of course, one variation. So I've, I'm always amazed how you guys play to create with them. 
once you get your hands on them. So order them. If you have chance before World Card Making Day, great. If not, put it on the calendar. Make time, right? Make time to not only benefit from what you create, but also all of the other benefits of the act of creating that brings it into your life. And then here's the last one. So those are six cards that we created with it using the Take Comfort um, specifically and Tiny Plants. If you don't have that one, highly recommend it. It's so cute. And then also captions. And then along with that, the triple plaque. So here are actual... So this one, so this way that this designer template works is that you trace the outside edge for this design, right? So that's your base design. If you want the inside design, then you basically follow these, this um, inner lining here and you could just trace around that for your guidelines. And then for the top layer, the smaller one, instead of tracing the outside, you would trace that inside line. And that's how you can get three and one designer templates uh, from this template specifically. And it, like I said, super cute on slim cards. I am so excited and I don't know, hopefully you guys, I mean, they haven't shipped, they'll start shipping on Monday if you start placing your orders today, but um, maybe you'll get a chance to play with it. But I'm so excited to use this even on my scrapbooks and or even doing a little cute DIY banner. Wouldn't that be really cute? Like a little cute DIY festive banner for a party or a celebration or something. Those are all day ideas that I think would be super fun with this new designer template too. All right, on top of that, over for World Card Making Day, which again, I shared the link at the top, we are doing a special on a few card or a few designer templates that we paired to make specific cards. And um, so you could check out those specific styles of what designer templates we paired. Uh, specifically, let me get there in my own page here. Um, we are highlighting the birthday kit and the birthday sentiment pack, which is super great additions. Um, this was released back in August, but if you haven't had a chance or you want to pick up more of the sentiment cards, oh, looks like mine got bent. Um, then those are really, really fun too, is that you have uh, always those birthday cards on hand. Okay, so those are a fun design, super easy with just... Again, the birthday sentiment pack and the birthday kit. Just those two will create endless birthday cards. So if you want those, if you buy two or more, you can save 10%. If you buy three or more, and I'll share the other designer templates, it's 15%. And buy four or more and you save 20% off of these specific sets that create fun styles of cards. Um, Kiwi Club members. Um, you actually will save uh, additional 10% off of the discounted price um, with your your VIP uh, Kiwi Club discount in that regards too. So keep that in mind. So you can save up to 20% and then an additional 10% off of the discount price. Um, okay, so the other ones that are super fun from a card style, you guys, these were so much fun. And again, if you have these designer templates, then great. We hope that the ideas inspire you, to inspire you to stock up on a few more cards in your stash but also to join us on October 1st, as I mentioned, and we all create cards together. It's a great time to set aside that side. And whether you decide to create similar of these card styles that I'm showing you using some of the designer templates that we're spotlighting or other cards of your choices. Um, either way, I hope that you will join us on actual World Card Making Day, October 1st. I think I said second a minute ago. It is first, okay? So this, these specific cards, these were used, um, created using the uh, Farmstead a la carte. I did also use the triple plaque here as that base background and then tiny, tiny seasons. So, so many different versions and ways that you can use just a, a set of designer templates. I know I've used um, farmstead and tiny seasons on not only DIY projects, my scrapbooks, but now look how, I mean, they're just so adorable on cards. And this is a slim card here as well. And so these fit in your typical, like, you know, business envelopes is what I call them. Um, 
Usually bills come in them, right, in the mail, this, this size, but what a nice change to get something like this in the mail that's not like a bill. I, I just keep thinking about how fun that is. Okay, here's another cute design, look how cute. And so you really, just any change of the season. So just changing that paper, of course, will change that look. And it's amazing the power of utilizing that paper stash, of course, along with some designer templates, what you can play to create in those. So those were just some fun ones. I think lots of versions and lots and styles. I look forward to, I hope that you, if you are inspired by these, you give them a try and then share them with us in the community so I can see what your version looks like because so many options there. And then another pairing that just works so awesome together for card making styles. If you're looking maybe for more feminine cards or like Mother Day cards or I love you cards or I'm thinking of you cards, um, we wanted to share these cards that were paired using Frolic and Blossom. So again, just those two sets with a few of your, your paper from your paper stash. Um, so pull in the paper. These of course were used with all the same paper, but the design in general, the, the overall design can be utilized in many different ways. And so really just a few sets, just limiting it to a few sets for whatever type of card styles, whether it is you're going for the birthday cards, whether you're going for a more calming feel card, or you're going for, again, more of that um, Mother's Day or I love you card, or maybe you want more of a traditional holiday card, right? So many fun ways and um, opportunities for um, different situations where cards are just so useful and nice to have on hand. So if you wanna take advantage of those uh, specials that we have going on in celebration of World Card Making Day that's coming up on October 1st, make sure to click on the link, like I mentioned. Um, I believe if you order, I'm trying to remember what the team said, it was like by September 22nd then you're you're in the clearing like you'll get them before october 1st your order um for the most part it usually ships the team's really good at getting orders out they're really amazing at that so even then but if you wanted to play it safe and you're like you know what i'm gonna make the time i'm gonna put it on my calendar on october 1st um then just grab whatever supplies you need or if you're interested in making specific cards say if you wanted to make these little card cars car cards <laughs> Um, that you would do that at least around or before September 22nd is what we recommend. So otherwise, um, the other thing that you can plan on uh, is if you spend $30 or more from now until October 5th, uh, you'll also get $5 back in Kiwi Cash. So just an extra uh, $5 back in Kiwi Cash that you can spend. So that's a fun little thing to count on as well. And for the most part, just when you have a you know opportunity, check out that link, head on over. Um, you can not only see the fun card designs, like I said, if, if there's some that inspire you and you have those designer templates, great. If you don't have them yet, um, pick them up so that you can create some adorable cards of your own to send out into the world to make it a brighter place. Um, it truly is uh, a, a meaningful hobby that um, just keeps on giving. Honestly, I, I'm just, the more I think about the purpose and the, the potential of just one card that is sent out to the world, it is, it's an amazing thing to think about. So, all right. Well, I've given you guys kind of the basic downloads. Um, I will, of course, will check back in throughout the week and, um, I look forward to hanging out with you guys on October 1st. So I'll of course be creating more cards. I think for me, I might create a few more of these little card cards or something because they're so fun. And I hope you guys enjoy the rest of your weekend. And like always, uh, keep playing to create and I'll see you guys in the community. All right, take care, bye guys.